There's mounting speculation Malcolm Turnbull may call an early election in the middle of the year. It's all because of the lack of action over his government's planned tax reforms, with nothing likely to be revealed before the May budget. Adam Todd joins us from Canberra. And Adam, the Treasurer talking about unicorns probably doesn't help. Well, Lachlan, and he also mentioned pixie horses for good measure. But just on the early election speculation, it still seems likely we'll be going to polls in the second half of the year, although July is now looking a definite possibility. But the truth is, the way this tax debate has run in recent weeks, this looks like a government that is nowhere near ready to fight an election. Interviews with the Treasurer are venturing into some strange places. I can sell them a fantasy or whatever you want to call it. Whatever you want to call it. Um, pixie horses, wh wh whatever your preferred um, analogy is. But the fantasy is meeting the reality. This is a Treasurer with very little to sell. What you're looking for is a silver bullet now. I'm looking, looking for, for that bloody vision that was promised five months ago and still hasn't appeared. Defending his lack of policies, the Treasurer said... We only started that process of looking at all those new areas in September of last year, after there was the change. They were not under consideration before that. That offended Tony Abbott, who issued a statement saying it is simply not true that the government only started looking at tax issues last September prompting the Treasurer to say his comments weren't meant to be a criticism of Mr Abbott or Joe Hockey, but a statement of chronology. Clearly concerned the tax debate is now hurtling out of control, the Prime Minister called a snap media conference late this afternoon and attempted to shift the focus back onto Labor and its negative gearing policy. Every homeowner in Australia has a lot to fear from Bill Short. Bill Shorten's policy is calculated to reduce the value of your home. His policies will make your home worth less. Fighting words amid speculation the government is now seriously considering an earlier election. Well, why don't you just double disillusion then? Get on with it. Well, that's an option. That is a live option. Of course it is. Of course, before that happens, the government better sort out its tax policies. Now, Bill Shorten released his negative gearing policy last Saturday, so it did seem a bit odd the PM felt the need to hold a sudden media conference this afternoon to criticise it. It has been the Treasurer who's been taking the lead on tax matters in recent days, and it has been suggested the PM's intervention this afternoon implies Scott Morrison has been falling short of the mark. Another big week in Canberra. Adam Todd, thank you very much.